Hello Aries. So this reading is going to have multiple categories. I'm going to have the involved Aries um, spread and also going to have a single reading for you guys and finance reading. So let's start with the general messages and then I go to the involved Aries. Universe, give me a three card spread. What messages do you have for Aries for the rest of this month? Okay, so you guys got guilt, love, regret, patience, and health. Okay, I feel like what the universe is trying to say, like if you knew what was going to happen before it happened, don't don't feel like you really messed up. Okay. Just take that as lesson learned. Just take that as trusting your own intuition, okay? Probably there was something that you felt like was 100% preventable because you already knew what was going to be the outcome, but you choose to just go against your intuition. Just take that lesson learned, but don't really dwell on it. Don't be caught up with that. Don't create anxiety, okay? That's what I'm seeing. Um, then I got patience. So I feel like we're trying to say is just be more patient, which is hard at some time. <laughs> as a fire sign. But be more patient. That's what I'm getting here. So let's look at the involved Aries. I feel like some of you guys are okay. So I was getting such with energy. So probably you guys are connecting with the Sag. So let's see. Universe, give me a four card spread. What's going on with involved Aries and the person that they are involved with for the rest of this month? Universe, give me two more cards. Universe, give me one more card. Okay. The strength card, Jenna Energy, is the Four of Cups. Okay, so the relationship doesn't look too bad. We just got two cards that are not the best. Um, the Four of Cups is about boredom. So some of you guys might feel like the spark is diminishing, is decreasing, you're kind of losing interest, okay? However, I feel like this is someone who's very dependable, very loyal to you, um, or it could be vice versa, okay? It could be like you're very loyal to them, but you feel like they're losing interest or the, the relationship is losing a spark, okay? The universe, clarify the Four of Cups. Six of Pentacles, the Emperor. Yeah, some of you guys are thinking, is this the is this really your person? Okay, that's how you think. I don't feel like you guys are cheating or wanting to cheat. It's just that you're you're trying to say, is this really your person? There was a couple of the Emperor and Six of Pentacles. Yeah. Wow. So someone is thinking like they're not too sure. So it could be you or it could be your person. But someone is not too sure if this is really the one. But the relationship doesn't look bad here, okay? It just, I do see losing of interest, loss of interest, I mean. So let's look at the other dog. Okay, universe, give me a four hearts spread. Universe, what's going to happen between involved Aries and the person that they're involved with for the rest of this month? Temperance, the sun, sacrifice, the strength card. A lot of Leo reference. Okay, so let's be in Leo season soon. Mirror effect, universe, give me one more card. And then there's a Sagittarius energy. Universe, give me one more card. Emperor, your energy, your energy is repentance. Hmm. Universe card from Emperor. J just be alone for now. It will be crappy. You are beginning to realize who you are. I feel like this is just a phase right now. Whoever is feeling like they're losing interest or lost interest, um, and not, not lost, but losing interest, I feel like they're going to snap out of it. Probably you are going to have a conversation with them about this, okay? What can you guys do to make sure um, you guys are meeting each other's needs and expectations, okay? 
that's what I'm saying. I feel like it's gonna be there. This is just a little phase, okay? So let's look at single areas. Some of you guys are gonna meet um, a Virgo, Aries, Taurus, Libra. Okay. So universe, give me a four card spread. Universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen for the single Aries for the rest of this month when it comes to their love life? Universe, give me two more cards. Universe, give me one more card. It look good. It don't look bad. That's good. You getting your mojo back. If you feel like you lost your mojo or you just, you know, you was feeling away when it comes to a person or a breakup, you don't care no more. <laughs> okay? I feel like you guys are getting back to you with, the, um, with this Queen of Wands. This fire energy getting back to you. Um, I do see you meeting someone who is going to be different than you with that King of Cups being here. Um, fire and water combination be interesting, but that tends to happen. Fire and water tends to link up all the time. Um, so I do see you meeting a water sign, particularly a Scorpio. Scorpio, I feel like, is one of the best signs for water for Aries, okay, compared to the other signs. Pisces is good, Cancer is common, but I think Scorpio, because you guys rule the same planet, Mars, um... It, it, you guys understand each other more okay but i do see you guys getting back to you you feeling good you're looking good you're attracting someone who um that you like okay this is not an option that you don't like universe clarify the judgment queen of swords this is someone who might be a little bit um controlling let's see what else okay universe clarify six swords They're a little controlling. And also, I do see a past person trying to come back to you guys as well. And But you you, you are going to scare them off, basically, because you're going to tell them off. Okay? That's what I'm seeing. Universe, clarify the King of Cups. Knight of Swords, Page of Wands. Yeah. So, there's a water sign that's coming your way, particularly a Scorpio, who might have Gemini in your chart. That's a good combination, actually. Scorpio, Moon, and Gemini. That's I'm bad. Even though it's not crazy, but <laughs> it's okay. So let's see. Let's look at finances. Let's see what's going on. Actually, let's see who's coming towards you, even though it's kind of fine. All right, so universe. Give me a three card spread. Who's coming to a single Aries when it comes to the love life for the rest of this month? Fulfillment. Choices and obedience. Yeah, it's a loyal person. Yeah, I'm thinking of the Scorpio. Because they're a fixed sign. Fixed signs tend to be loyal. Um is a Scorpio most likely, or this person have a lot of Scorpion energy, okay? And then there is someone, yeah. So this is someone who's gonna be very infatuated with you. Very loyal, I like that, that's good energy. Let's look at um, finances now. Okay. So, universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen with Aries finances for the rest of this month? Six of Cups. Universe, give me three more cards. What's going to happen to Aries finances for the rest of this month? The Moon and Eight of Cups. Universe, give me two more cards. The Hierophant. Universe, give me one more card. Justice. Eight of Swords. Okay, so this is ongoing because I got a lot of Cancer reference. It's, it's still Cancer season. So this probably started since be um, beginning of late June. Um, this could be like you're paying stuff down, like probably you're paying early property tax, early um, you're paying your paying taxes quarterly as well. Like it could be something like that. Um, 
but you may feel like hmm, this is about universe covering also what i'm getting is there might be something from the past when it comes to your finances that's coming back okay so this could be like like a a hospital bill this could be a collections okay let's see but i feel like you guys are able to um like kind of like kind of resolve that issue universe clarify the justice eight of pentacles yeah you're gonna work on it universe cover eight of pentacles you just may feel like it's another expense that you didn't really expect this um month okay but i see you're able to work through it finances don't look bad it just you may feel like um there was another expense that you was not expecting this month okay let's look here Universe, give me a two card spread. What messages do you have for Aries when it comes to their finances for the rest of this month? Give me a two card spread. House and courthouse. Interesting. And then expectation. For some reason, it showed that you was not expecting it. So probably you was expecting it happening later. Probably not this month though, okay? So some bills coming up. Um, I feel like you're able to resolve it though, okay? It could be maintaining a home it could be relating to taxes okay so let's look at this one. okay universe give me a four card spread what messages do you have for aries when it comes to the career finances a lot of cards. Universe, give me one more card. Jenna energy is overcoming obstacles. You can overcome anything. Yeah, so this could have, could be something that is resurfacing again, but you're able to tap it, it down. Okay, you're able to pay it off or pay it down. Gates of trumpet, success expands in your life. So when it comes to career you're still gonna you're if you at a really good position top position i feel like you're still able to maintain that position some of you guys who are wanting to get to the next level i feel like you guys are um look at the bigger picture from when such cherry is wise leader you are beacon for others protected by the angels you're cherished by the angels unknown territory you're exactly where you need to be and keep going forward yep so i do see you on your ish okay you're extremely motivated valent courage take action with passion and then solitude and science peace prevails okay so this is you doing your own thing this could be you opening your own business doing things more independently okay that's insane so you're on the right path that's with the with the career you're on the right path um if there's any type of unexpected like a unexpected expense or expense that you knew was going to happen but just not now i feel like you're able to take care of that okay so that's the reading that I have for you, Aries. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If